What's up guys, JFM here, welcome back to another Minecraft Pocket Edition video! Today I'm back with another episode of the Let's Play! I am super, super excited because if you guys did not see yesterday's video and maybe you haven't checked if you don't have a Twitter or, or I don't know, you may have missed something huge. 0.13.0 has been released in beta form. We have beta builds, or alpha builds, I'm not sure what they're called, but anyways, yeah! So we have a ton of awesome stuff to check out today. I am super, super pumped. As always, be sure to smash that like button if you guys enjoy the episode. And, uh, yeah, I think we can have a little bit of fun. Now, first things first, I do want to mention that in this new build, uh, you can't actually take dogs with you. So that's kind of annoying. I was going to take Buddy with us today, but unfortunately, that cannot happen. But, uh, you know, it is what it is. So, Buddy, you'll just have to sit here on this pole forever and ever. Hopefully we can get that fixed soon, but uh, let's move along and uh, get started with some of the new features in 0.13.0. If you guys don't know, redstone was actually added. There were a few different mobs added, or at least one new mob. What's up with these? Oh, are all? Oh no, are all the trap doors messed up? Jeez Louise, I think all the trap doors are messed up. We gotta place all these back. Uh, but yeah, we should be good, and uh, oh, there's one here as well. So, uh, yeah, uh, let's see, let's see, let's see, what to do first. Well, first things first, oh yeah, and the numbers also change, the numbers are pretty big now. I want to make a new set of doors. Oh, ho -ho! look at that, we get three oak doors. Oh, these are awesome, I like them. Those are dark oak doors. What else could I make? I really want spruce doors. Can I make spruce doors? Because I don't think I actually want to use those. Do I have any spruce? If not, I think I'll just run and grab some. But, um, let's see, let's see, let's see. Do I have any spruce wood? I don't think I do. Yeah, I don't think I do on me. But I'll go grab some really quick. And, uh, we can, we can make some doors out of it. I think it's gonna be sweet. Look at this zombie trying to take over my land. Get back here, boy. You can't, you don't stand a chance. You don't, you don't stand a chance against me. All right. Well, actually, you're doing pretty good. Whoa, you're taking a few hits. And the armor must have been... Armor must have been enchanted with some pretty powerful enchantments, but uh, yeah, so I'll run over to the spruce, and good thing, good thing I guess, is we'll pass right by the finished pumpkin. Now this thing took ages to finish, man, this took a long time, but I've got the stem on the top, and this is what we built for Halloween. Now this is the inside, I want to coat the inside so you don't see all the freaky pumpkin skulls, and I guess I can figure out what to do later with that. I think we'll probably just turn it into a pumpkin farm, I think that would be pretty cool, but I'm not sure. You guys. Can can let me know, but that's a pretty awesome building right there. And yes, of course, uh, the back is all done as well. So I think it looks great. I really, really like it. Now what we gotta do is we gotta go over here and get some spruce wood. I also wanna jump to the jungle so I can make some jungle wood doors as well because the new doors are probably one of my favorite parts, obviously besides redstone of this new update. This new spruce wood door, it looks really, really cool and I think it'll look awesome on the church. So I'll probably place these doors on the church and then I'll get some jungle wood wood and I'll place the jungle wood maybe on the hobbit house. I don't know. I think the new doors look so much better than the traditional doors and I think it would be cool if the traditional doors got an update but at the same time a lot of people probably really like the traditional doors and they probably don't want them changed so I'm fine with it. I just really really like all of the new doors. I think they're all really really cool. So I'll just grab a little bit of jungle wood here. I'm not sure if I have any but it won't take long. Just I'll just grab this tree and then we can head back and uh, work on making some new doors and placing them in some of the builds. I also want to go on the search for rabbits because those guys are brand new. They were just added and I want to find some and I want to capture some. So here we go. We're at the uh, crafting table here and we can make a few spruce wood planks as well as some jungle wood planks. As you can see, uh, I like the I like the spruce door. I think it's going to be pretty cool. And I also like the jungle door as well. So this is the normal one. But we have uh, this jungle door and the spruce door. Now, the spruce door, I think, is going to look good on the church. I don't know. I, the dark oak kind of looks too much like a house. But this one reminds me a little bit of a castle door. So uh, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. We'll break this up. And uh, we'll see if this spruce door does the trick. That does do the trick. Look at that. 
That looks awesome! I love that! I absolutely love it. So we'll leave that. Oh, and all these are not supposed to be closed. These are supposed to be open to act as handrails. But that's pretty sweet. I definitely like it. And this is, by the way, what the church looks like without the uh, texture pack. Now, if I if I can, I may actually want to replace this glowstone with the redstone uh, with the redstone lamps. I may want to do that. I don't know. It may be difficult because you actually have to have them powered now, but... I could probably give it a go. I'll flip all of these trap doors down. And we can go try to find, um... Let's find another door to replace. I know, I know for a fact I want to replace the front door. So we'll go over there now, and we will place one of these jungle doors on it. And I think the jungle door is gonna look... Oh my goodness. What in the world is going on with that? <laughs> that is a major bug. <laughs> Okay, well, uh, you know, it, it's, it's, it's a brand new build, everyone. It's a brand new build. So, we'll take this off and let's try a jungle door. That, I like. I really do, but it may be a little bit off. Let's try, you know what? Maybe we just try one of the spruce doors again. Let's try a spruce door again. Let's see if a spruce door looks better. I think that looks better. I really do. I think this looks better. I like it. I like the spruce door. So, we'll keep the spruce door. I don't know what I could use this for, though. Maybe... Maybe something else. I, I, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. But for now, it's pretty good. So I'll put away these extra doors here. I'll figure out somewhere to use them later on. But for now, another thing that I really, really want to do is make a few pressure plates. So let's see. Let's see. Can I just make some wooden ones? Yeah, let's just make some wooden pressure plates. I probably should make a few, so we'll just do a few pressure plates, maybe five. And then this is going to make opening and closing doors oh, so much easier. So I can just do that. Oh, that's awesome. And then I'll put one out here. Maybe this should be a stone one. Yeah, this shouldn't should be a stone one. All right, we'll grab some smooth stone, and we can use uh, some... Yes, so I do have some smooth stone. Awesome, 13 smooth stone. I will make a smooth stone pressure plate. And that will go, I think, with the gravel a little bit more. So uh, hopefully this looks good, but we'll see, we'll see, we'll see. So this one will go on the outside right there. Yeah, that goes much better with the gravel, so I can easily run in and run out without even touching the door. That's awesome! These new features are absolutely incredible. So I probably want to do that on the church as well. So let me go over there, and I can get that done. Into the crafting table we go. We can make a stone and a wooden pressure plate. Oh, I already had plenty of wooden ones, but that's fine. I'm, I'm good with them. The more, the merrier, especially with pressure plates, because these things are awesome. So I'll place this right here, and I'll probably replace, I'll probably add a gravel trail, but for now, that looks fine, and then I can place this right here and uh, there we go awesome 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 what else could I do with redstone I really don't know because there are no repeaters yet so there's nothing major I can do but or pistons really so there's not too much actually um I don't know yeah this update man what is <laughs> what's going on what is this dude is that from the cat I think it is it's from the cats that's what it is the cats are so glitched out! Look at their heads! <laughs> Look at the cats' heads! Oh, that's hilarious! Well, I can't mess around with the cats, that's for sure. So I'll go back here, and I guess we'll look for... I don't know, maybe we can look for bunnies. But first things first, I do want to take a quick nap, and, uh, and then we can get a move on with the rest of everything. Ah, lovely! And these cats' heads are coming through the house now. <laughs> Those are awesome. Also, I thought maybe why not just switch that up to... Uh, yeah, that looks good. I like that. I like that look. Now, do I have the pressure plate anywhere else in here? here. I don't think I do. Uh, I could probably add it. Yeah, I think a stone pressure plate would look good here, maybe? I don't know. We'll figure this out, but that looks fine for now. Oh, we got a spider in the house! We got a spider in the house. This is no good. No bueno. Are the dogs messed up? No, the dogs aren't messed up. It's just, it's, it's just those, it's just those kittens. It's just those felines. So, now what I think we'll do is we'll head on the lookout for uh, let's see. Well, yeah, let's go. Let's go search for some, uh, for some lovely, lovely little hoppers. We'll try to find some bunnies. I don't actually know if these guys naturally spawn or what, but, uh, I'm not seeing any, so I don't know if they do. I probably should have checked beforehand, but I don't really want to go out far if they're not, if they're not going to spawn, and it doesn't look like they are. So I'll wait for another episode to find a bunny, and then maybe make some stew out of it. Oh, look how cool this looks really quick, though. Look at that. Look how cool that pumpkin looks. I love it. Awesome. So, uh, what we'll do, I guess, for the rest of the day is figure out something to do with redstone, or at least place some redstone down. I think it'll be pretty cool. 
So with this 51 redstone right here, I really want to go to the cemetery. Now, I don't think I'll have the comment screenshotted like I usually do, and I'm sorry for that. But um, I, I did see an incredibly great idea that said put blood in the cemetery by placing down redstone. It'll look a little bit like dripped blood, so I want to give it a go and see if this works like it's supposed to. So maybe put a little bit of blood right there. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. I like it though. I like it. I just don't know where to put it. Let's see. Let's see. Maybe maybe some blood right here. Yeah, there we go. Some blood right there. Yeah, that looks awesome. And then we'll put some blood right there. Um, but it does like it needs to be a line, but that's that's too linear. So maybe that's fine. Yeah, that's fine. And then uh, we'll put some right up here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay. And I think it looks really really good on a turn. So we'll keep it right there. And that looks good. I'll take it, I'll take it, I'll take it. And then maybe we'll just put a little bit of blood right here. Put a little bit of blood right here. And then a splotch of blood right there. And then a bit of blood right there. And then some blood right here. Now that is awesome. So there's blood all over the cemetery, which makes it a lot scarier than it should be. I mean, cemeteries are really not that scary. If you go to them, they're they're very peaceful. But this one is a spooky cemetery. It was built for Halloween. It's got to be spooky. It's got to have blood. So, yeah, there we go. Blood in the cemetery. That's one use for redstone. We still haven't actually found a real use for redstone, though. What could I actually use this redstone for? All right, change of plans. You guys have to give me ideas because I really have no clue what I can do. I, I I don't know. Without, you know, without pistons or repeaters, there's not much you can do with redstone. Although eventually, once those things are added, I really want to have a working light system outside using light sensors. I want to have awesome railways. I want to have everything. But for now... I think we're gonna go on the hunt for uh, for some for some awesome bunnies because I just asked on Twitter and a lot of people said they do spawn naturally. I wasn't sure if they if they do or not because they're brand new and I'm not sure maybe they were just added in creative. But uh, people were saying they did, so let's go on the lookout. They're pretty rare, but we'll see if we can find one. Now I don't have my compass with me, so I got to be very careful. But I'm really not seeing them, so I don't know. I really. I don't know if I'm doing something wrong. Maybe they only spawn in grasslands, although I would think bunnies spawn in forests, right? I don't know. I really, really don't know. I'll continue looking, though, because I really want to find these guys. And it's a great source. It's a great easy way for me to get food, cooked food. All i got to do is just jump, and uh, whoops, I'm supposed to get a critical. Come back here. There we go. Perfect. So, uh... Yeah, I don't know. I don't know. Let's keep trying to find them, though, because bunnies are awesome. They're super, super fun. And, uh, they just take a little while to find, I guess. But, uh, hopefully we can. Hopefully we can. It looks to me like, yep, yeah, the sun is about to set. And I'm just around, uh, my house, so I'll jump back in. I, I didn't have any luck going that way. I went straight to the jungle, and I'm pretty sure the rabbits wouldn't spawn in the jungle. So, I'll go ahead and take a quick, nice nap, and then I'll head out in this direction. See if I can find any of those guys, because I really, really want to get a, get a, get a few, get, just get a few. I really want to kill them, though. Because <laughs> you can't keep them as pets, and they'll run away from you. But, they do have... They do have rabbit's feet, and you know what happens with rabbit's feet, right? Oh, I forgot I can. I don't have to open that. I'm gonna have to get used to that. But you know what happens when you get rabbit's feet? You can get leaping potions. And what is funner to mess around with than leaping potions? Off we go to a new dimension. Not really, though. We're gonna go maybe past where the village is. Um, oh, and I do want to make sure I stop and get all the food along the way. Oops, failed to get the critical there. But I still get some steak. I'll take it before it burns. Uh, oh, there's a zombie with a cap over there, I think. Is that what it is? Oh, yeah, we'll grab that. Oh, I did not ag did it again, man. Let's try this. Oh, I don't even have to jump to get the criticals on these guys. These guys just die right away. But what is that? Oh, it's a skeleton. And since he has a cap on, he's not burning to death. But now he's burning to death because my weapon is absolutely incredible. Uh, but let's see. What else? What else? What else? Nothing over here? Very difficult to see with all that flame in my face, but, uh... Yeah, look at this guy right here. Perfect. So we get a lot of food doing this. So even if we don't find bunnies, I still, you know, I still get, I still, there's still a bonus for doing this. Just a ton of food. Cooked food. Another leather-capped zombie. Nope, I did it again. It's a skeleton. It's a skeleton this time, too. Okay, we'll take him on. And we'll get that last critical, and he will explode all over the place. Let's see. I think we keep going this way, right? Unless maybe we could check this out. Let's see. Let's see what's over here, because... 
Are bunnies going to try to eat the crops, maybe? We'll see if the crops are attracting any bunnies. Hello, village! Welcome! Welcome! No, I- you guys need to be welcoming me. That's not how this thing works. Well, anyways, do we have any, uh... Do we have any little bunnies here? Do we have any little bunnies that I can, uh, visit and talk to and kill? Just one. Just one or two. Just one or two. I'm, I'm not gonna kill them all. I love bunnies, but I really wanna- I really wanna get some potions. I really wanna get some leaping potions. Where are they? No bunnies, really? You guys need to find some bunnies for me. Promise? Hope so. Still no bunnies. I have gone almost everywhere. Where are these guys? These guys are so elusive. I just can't find them. They're supposed to be in forests and plains biomes, but I have not seen one, and I've gone through a ton of plains and a ton of forest. I don't know. I don't know what I'm doing wrong. Maybe I'll try to send off this world to someone else, see if they can get one. I, I, I don't know. I really don't know what to do. I don't know what to do, but I want to find bunnies. Okay, guys, so I don't, where am I? Where am I? Is that, okay, oh, that's my church over there. All right, so um, I just gave my world to my buddy RJ, and uh, he said he, he, he figured out what was wrong, and he fixed it, so I should be able to find him now. I, I don't know what that means. I don't know if he just added them in. I have no clue. But they're rabbits, so I should have been able to find them. I should, like, they should be out here somewhere. So, um, I don't know. Yeah, my stuff looks like it's in different places, so maybe that's what he did. I don't know. But, like I said, they're rabbits. They're supposed to be in the plains. It's not supposed to be hard to find. So, if I can look around, I still don't see any, though, so maybe... Do I have to go further over here? Okay, yeah, I see, I still see everything but rabbits. I still see everything but rabbits. Oh, no. Oh, is that, is that another one right there? Oh my goodness. They're all rabbits, look at that. Oh, and they run away from you too. I think I found a pocket of them. This is awesome, so. Oh, look at these cute little guys. Now, will they run away from me if I'm sneaking? That's the thing, do they? I don't know if they do. It looks like they might, but they're so cute! Look at those guys! They're so cute! Unfortunately for them, I do want to kill them, though. I do want to kill them. And, uh, yeah, what's up, guys? Guys, 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 I do want to kill you. I'm sorry, I'm sorry, I'm so sorry, I'm so sorry. Come back, 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 come back here! I know, I know it's painful, I know it's painful to see. I know it's painful to watch, I know it's painful. Are these kids? I can't even tell if they're young. No, they're not. Awesome. So, I have three rabbit sides, and I still haven't found a rabbit's foot yet. Um, but yeah, I definitely want to find one to keep as a pet. I'll lure it in with carrots, I think is what you use. But, uh, oh, there's another one over here. For now, I really- Oh, that's a baby. I'm not gonna kill the baby. I want him to grow up and make a family. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. They're so cute. I really don't think they should have made him- uh, I don't think they should have made- <laughs> I don't think they should have made him food because they're so cute. But, uh, I really- All I want is a rabbit's foot. And then I'll stop killing rabbits. I won't kill them ever again. All I need is a rabbit's foot, though. Oh, <gasps> is this another one? It is another one! Look at that! It's another one! I'm sorry, oh, and it's another little guy! Oh, jeez, these guys are fast! Look at this! Now, this is how you get him. You gotta push him up to a wall, and did he drop a rabbit's foot? No, he did not. So, no rabbit's feet as of yet. I'll keep on the lookout, though. We'll see if we can get one. Um, I guess, it, I guess they're spawning now. So, it's probably gonna be pretty easy to find these guys. So, just gotta look and see where they are gonna spawn. Maybe they just- Oh, there's another one! Look! See how they spawn all over the place! And another! This is, I think, how they're supposed to be able to be found. But, uh, we'll see if we can get this guy. We'll see if we can get him. See if we can get him and get some legs from him. I'm so sorry, little guy! I'm so sorry! Did I get a foot? Did I get a foot? Did I get a foot? Still no rabbit's foot, but I'm getting plenty of rabbit's hide and plenty of rabbit meat. I spy another one down here. Awesome. So we'll grab this one as well and just come back to me really, really quick. There we go. Did I get a rabbit? So I did. I got a rabbit's foot. <laughs> Let's go. All right. So I'm done. I won't kill any rabbits, at least for a long, long time. I'm done. I know they're so cute. They're adorable. I really don't want to kill them. And I don't want to kill them all because I, oh, I think that one just spawned right in my face. So, uh, yeah, that's good. So, I'm not gonna kill anymore. Yeah, they're plenty now. They should, I think they, whatever happened, I think he must have actually fixed the spawning issue. I don't think he spawned them in, really, because 
It looks like they're spawning now. So it's not like, not like they were just placed there. It looks like they're spawning all over the place. So that's pretty cool. Um, but yeah, now I can finally make a leaping potion. This is going to be awesome. So I can make that and uh, I won't kill any more rabbits until I know I have an awesome farm of them going. And these cat's eyes, man, what is going on? Jeez, that's so weird. <laughs> so we'll run into the brewing room and we will get started on making a rabbit potion. So I will take two glass bottles, go into my water duct, and nope, come on, there we go, and there we go, perfect. So two glass bottles, jeez, that's going to be annoying, those cats, man. And uh, we'll put the water bottles in here, and I think all I need now is a little bit of nether wart, and I don't know if I have any, but I'll just go ahead and run over to my... uh run over to my farm here and grab some. Very, very simple. And uh, we'll take this over to the brewing stand, which is unfortunately <laughs> blocked by a cat's head that's going through my whole house. And uh, we'll get this going. Now, I just want to make sure I'm going to do the right recipe, so I'll give it a go here. I'll just look it up really quick and make sure it's working. All right, so I looked it up, and okay, that's done. Now, all I need to do after that is just place in the rabbit's foot. Now, I can also... Um, I can also add redstone or glowstone dust to it to, uh, I think glowstone makes it more powerful and redstone makes it last longer, but obviously, I think I want to go glowstone, so we'll see if I can grab any. Do I have any glowstone? I hope I didn't use it all. I think I might have used it all. Oh, that's a bummer. I think I used all my glowstone, or it's probably in one of my chests uh, at one of my builds. So I guess I'll just add, uh, I'll add, uh, I'll add just redstone. I'll add redstone to one of them later. For now, I just want to see how good this potion works. So we'll give this a go, and it'll be the last thing we do today. So potion of leaping with jump boost. Oh, these things opened up again. Wow, that's weird. I mean, that's another bug that we got to fix. But uh, yeah, let's go ahead and see if this thing works. Oh my goodness, I'm excited. I really wish I had a po more powerful one, but this works nicely. It works nicely. Jump boost, I think one. It's probably going to say one back there, but let's try it out. So let's see if we do this. Can I jump up to this block? Oh, I can't. Okay, so it's it's just going to get me. Is it going to get me over a fence, though? So I really, really should have got a higher powered one. This one isn't that cool, but it will get me over this fence, right? I hope it will. It does. Okay, it gets me over the fence. That's pretty good, but that's about the only thing it's good for. So, really anticlimactic, actually. But um, if I made it more powerful with glowstone, I think I would have had a little bit of a better time. But, yeah, so we finally have a potion of leaping. That was one of the potions I've always wanted to make, and we finally have. Let me know what you guys thought. If you guys enjoyed this episode, please go ahead and smash that like button. I know we didn't get too much done. There's just not a lot new to do without those new redstone additions like repeaters and pistons and stuff. But once those things are added, I will surely, surely, surely... Uh, I have a ton more stuff to build. So that's basically it. Hopefully you guys did enjoy. I'll talk to you all later. And as always, stay frosty, my friends. Peace, guys. See ya. Bye-bye.